Uh, we're standing in the Willard Sparks Beef Research Center at Oklahoma State University. Um, it's a research feedlot that we're able to do research for the industry. So we have a CAFO license, a concentrated animal feeding operation license for 980 animals. And so we, we can't average more than 980 animals throughout the year. We're generally not that full, uh, but there, there's times where we would be very close to our capacity. And, and then there's other times of the year where we might be closer to 700 to 750 animals. So we study the, the health and the management. How, how can we enhance the, the well-being of those calves by managing their nutrition and managing their health? We employ about five undergrads and there'll probably be about six to ten graduate students throughout, throughout the year. Um, on given work days we'll have ten to fifteen um, additional people come out to help us work cattle and collect data for whatever research projects that we have currently going on. It's a great opportunity for those students to get hands-on experience at running a feed yard. We feed twice daily, we work cattle. Um, it's an extremely valuable opportunity for students in their undergrad to get exposed to the beef industry if they haven't been previously exposed. And if they have been, it's a great opportunity to help increase their skill levels. For one, I think it's a good little source of income. It allows them to have a few extra dollars, but it's also a great stepping stone. It allows them to be exposed to research, the research side of the industry, and allows them to get a, again, a greater depth of the reasons why we do what we do in the industry. And it also gives them a great network opportunity because we have a lot of drug reps and a lot of industry leaders come out and work with us and gives them a chance to, to meet those people and network and broaden their horizons with companies. We do a lot of studies uh, with our industry colleagues. And so as they are developing new products, new growth technologies, we're often one of the very first institutions that gets to test those products in a practical setting. What you see behind us is the Instantech feeding system. It's from the Netherlands and what it is, it allows us to, to monitor those animals and understand their individual intake. So basically anytime an animal comes to eat out of one of the feed bunks here, we, mon we record it and it lets us know how much the animal is eating and what time of day that animal is eating that, the feed. The Instantech feeders was a really nice addition to this facility and so it allows us to uh, group house cattle, but yet look at individual animal feeding and water intake behavior. And there's very few institutions uh, that have the capability to do confined feed yard types of, of experiments. I think this experience has helped me be able to tie research together with industry and understand you know, the research aspect of why research is important and how we can apply that in the industry setting.